Good afternoon, folks. This is Steve Rhodes coming to you live from the shores of sunny Delray Beach, Florida. This is your 1 p.m. update. Currently, I have all the U.S. indices trading the upside with two exceptions. The S&P is off two points, so it's flat. New York Stock Exchange down 18 points. That's about one-tenth percent to the downside. We've got the Dow up 35 points, one-tenth. The NDX is up three-tenths, or 37 points. The Russell's up three-tenths, six points. Semis are up a half a percent. That's 15 points to the upside. Gold's up $7. Trade out at $17.89. Silver up 17 pennies. 20.37 is the print there. Got late sweet crude back $4.70. Trade out at 93.92. Natural gas is back 10 cents. She's trading out at 8.12. And the 30-year treasury up 21. 30 seconds. Trading out at 144.21. Let's go figure out what most of this means out here. If we take a look at the ES mini upper left-hand side, you'll see the A to B equals CD pad. That remains in effect unless we get a bearish reversal candle. Short of that, price should go target its next level. Its next level is 42.26. Spot volatility still well below the 50-day exponential moving average. And that exponential moving average is 25.95. The spot fix at 22.42. That is helpful to the ES mini. The NQ is testing resistance. You can see the A to B equals CD pattern. It's running right into resistance, the top of its weekly profile. That is priced at 13.004. U.S. dollar index uh, failing, uh, headed back into the 103 level. You've got the oscillator and change line around 103 and change, and you've got the uh, bullish structured weekly profile between 103.17 and 103.91. So that looks like where the U.S. dollar wants to head to. Gold trading above both the top of its weekly profile and daily profile. Those levels are at the 1778 area. That suggests a further move higher. Further to where? We'll have to go take a look at that during the Trader's Edge show. We'll pull up the uh, gold charts to do that. Silver is trading above both the top of its daily and weekly profile as well. So we'll have to pull up those charts to figure out where price is likely headed to. Got light sweet crude, which still is just consolidating with inside its daily profile. I know it's a pretty decent move down, four bucks and change. It's also trying to form a new weekly profile. So strong support exists at about 90.98, 91.19. If we take a look at natural gas, I know that it has tested and so far rejected its oscillator and change line. So this may be the uh, all we're going to get as far as a retracement out there but if that oscillator change line fails we'd look at price moving back to about 723 747 30 year treasury continues higher it's in an a to b will cd to the upside folks stay tuned for the trader z show but if you have to start your monday have a magnificent one and we'll look forward to seeing you again soon take care now